Okay, um, welcome to live trade videos. Yes. So today we're going to be treating pending orders. And we are working with the stop order, which is the buy stop and the sell stop orders. Working on the system. That's on the laptop, on the PC, in the screen, on the screen, on the large screen. So we're working with those pending orders. All right? Yeah. Um, for instance, we have Euro USD. So before you place a pending order, you need to have the instrument you are working with. In this case, now we are working with the euro versus the USD. And we already have our pending orders here. We already have the pending orders to work with here. You understand? So basically, I can just click or I can just start placing the trades. If, for instance, you wanted to work out your pending order yourself, a, pay, a buy stop and a sell stop pending order can only be placed like this, as follows. A buy stop will be placed above the current market price with the take profit above it for a buy. And a sell stop will be placed below the current market price with the take profit below it. But now we already have the pending orders we want to work with, so we can just go ahead into the chart. I click on new order new order and when i click on new order i want to select pending order so i'll click on pending order there then the type of order so i'll click here as buy stop buy stop so once i click on buy stop it asks me for the price at which i want to enter it here this is at what price and at this point is the take profit point so i just need to get the prices out the third one here is a stop loss so is, this is the entry price. This is where I want to place my buy stop. This is where I want to take the profit on the buy stop. And this is where I want to set stop loss on the buy stop. So I just come here, take my buy stop entry. So I copy that. I, 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 I highlight it. Copy it. Then I come here and paste. At what price? So I right click here and paste. Then I come back, I take the take profit points for this Euro USD trade now. I copy it. I come to the MT4 and I paste. So in this scenario now, we're not working with the stop loss. So I can leave the stop loss point blank. And now I place my buy stop order. I see it, voila, it's already placed. It's already placed here on the chart. You can see it at the bottom of the screen, inactive until the trade triggers. So you see that a buy stop is placed above the current market price. This is the current market price here at 1.01590. 1 so it's placed above this, you understand? Then the sell stop. So for the sell stop now, I just click on new order again. Type, I click on pending order. Then I select the sell stop pending order. So you see the same thing at the price. This is the price where I want to enter it. This is the point at which I want to take profits. And this is where I set the stop loss. So I just go to my given entries, highlight the sell stop, copy it, come to the chart here, paste. Then I go back, copy the take profit points, and come to the chart. Paste. So since we're not working with a stop loss as well, I can go ahead and place this sell stop pending order. Huh? So um, in the next video, we'll be showing how you can place this with mobile. You understand? How you can place the buy stop and sell stop order with mobile. All right.